Welcome to the evolution of esports, where you don't just play the game, you code it. The Code Combat AI League allows you to showcase your coding skills in a fun and competitive format. This community-based experience offers a new environment for players to practice coding and reinforce what they've learned. Each season, two new arenas will launch. Our regular season arenas tend to be simpler and easier to play. The finals arena will launch in the last month of each season, require a deeper knowledge of the coding concepts, and qualify the winners for great prizes. When you're first starting out, there are two easy ways to get into an AI League arena level. The first is when logged into your account at codecombat.com slash play. Just enter into any of the Code Combat worlds and click the button on the top left for the most up-to-date arena level. The second way to get into an arena is from codecombat.com forward slash league. Scroll down and click the big button under the featured leaderboard. The arena levels allow players to put their code up against others from around the globe. You can select who to compete against, and the asynchronous battles simulate the match and register the scores as wins or losses. See if you can make the top 10. The top right of the graph shows you what place you're in worldwide. In this case, I'm 3,665th in the world for this arena. No matter where you are on the leaderboard, keep scrolling and you will see yourself eventually. There I am, highlighted in green. Now let's actually go into the arena. From the leaderboard, click on the green play button and select either a human or computer opponent and the level of difficulty. When you first join an arena, be sure to review the introduction page to understand the goals and basics of how to play. The blue box tutorial messages will help explain how the arena works. The map is where all the action happens, showing your heroes and your competition battling it out. Your code editor features some starter code to get you into the action quickly. Looking for what methods you can use in your code? Check the methods list and click on each one to learn more about what they can do. If you've used Code Combat or Ozaria before, the code should look pretty familiar. Your hero is still the object for your commands. In each arena, you'll have different methods you can use. And the methods can be customized with different arguments. Start with the basic methods first before exploring the more advanced ones. When you are ready to rumble, hit the Run button to see your code in action. The scroll bar allows you to quickly navigate through the simulation to see what's working and what's not. Health bar. Yes, it's pretty important to stay upright in battle. If you're stuck, the Hints button can help. You can also reload the code to just wipe everything clean and start from the beginning. Ready to see where you rank? Head to the arena ladder and submit your code for ranking. Want to start a team of your own? A getting started guide can be found in the teacher dashboard. For competitors to get the most out of the experience, we recommend players complete Ozaria Chapter 1 or Code Combat CS1 before competing in one of our arena levels. These introductory courses will give players the foundational basics of methods and arguments that are needed to participate. But if players are looking to reach the top of the leaderboard, some arenas will require additional exposure to more advanced concepts like variables, lists, and conditionals. Enjoy the AI League today. Competitive coding has never been so epic.